Hello, um, today we're going to be doing a video about Windows 7 uh, DVD maker which comes with I think all the Windows 7 editions I know it definitely comes with uh, Windows 7 and Premium because this is what I am using so if you just go ahead and launch Windows 7 DVD maker and pretty basic user interface here back to old school by the looks of it <laughs> and you literally this is where it looks like when you open it up and to add files it literally press the add files icon and you can uh, add whatever files you would like to burn to a DVD or if you've already got a pro uh, project file of project file go ahead and find it uh, good feature of this uh, it doesn't just let you burn it, you can also uh, edit some basic DVD options like oh and you can also create your own DVD menu which I'll be showing in a minute uh, play video to the end with DVD menu play video in continuous loop uh, DVD aspect ratio you want to go for 16 by 9 and video format NT SC and this is just your burning speed so you can have slow, medium or fast and that's the basics so we are going to call mine Peter K oh, I'm going to add the Phoenix Club se episode series 1 go to there add files their windows will add the files and then click next then you'll be presented with this and this is where you create your DVD menu which will appear before you can watch the videos so preview this is what it'll be like when you insert the disc into your DVD player which is quite cool and you can diff pick different scenery backgrounds and again you can even customize the menu or you can even create your own and then you can type what you want in the buttons here and here even create some notes or a slideshow if you want <laughs> instead and then literally just press burn and away it goes it'll uh, do its thing and then DVD is then playable on any PC or DVD player. So, that is it to do with Windows 7 DVD Maker. Cheers! Oh, stop you stupid thing. And this is the end result of my uh, DVD being made of PTK Phoenix Night Series 1. Let's go ahead and launch that now. reading this now people obviously I've already uh, this is what this is the actual beginning screen because I've already watched it so it will be to there and you can all the episodes work so is it episode one two three four five six Obviously the picture quality is not going to be brilliant, that's nothing to do with the DVD maker, that's the files itself, because it's obviously not a very good files anyway, so that don't be put off by the quality shown there, it depends entirely on the quality of the videos you are putting on. So, that has been Windows 7, thank you.